Hello everyone, welcome to Coders Camp and today we are going to cover another linked list problem that is swapping nodes in a linked list. So we are given a head of the linked list and an integer k and we have to swap the elements at position k from the first and the last of the linked list. So let's understand this problem with an example. So here is a given linked list and the integer k given here is 2. So now we have to swap the kth node from head of the linked list and the kth node from last of the linked list and return the head of the linked list. So now we are going to use two pointer technique that is pointer 1 is going to point at the node from the first and the pointer 2 is going to point at the node from the last and we have to swap the values of the nodes. So finding p1 is pretty easy that is from head of the list we are going to travel or move the pointer for k times. So now if you see the distance from head of the linked list to pointer 2 is same as that of the distance from pointer 1 and end node. After moving head by k times it will be pointing at pointer 1. So we are going to start iterating our pointer 2 from head of the list and move both the pointers head and p2 simultaneously until head meets null. So once we travel head to null our p2 pointer will automatically will be pointing at where it has to be and once we place pointer 1 and pointer 2 it is easy for us to swap the values. So now let's see how are we going to code it. So we are going to have our pointers p1 and p2 where p1 starts from null and p2 is going to start from head and one more temporary node result where we are going to return it as the head of the new linked list after swapping. So once that is done we are going to iterate our head pointer to point at p1 k times. So we are going to move our head k times. So now we had moved our head to the pointer 1 or the first cell from head where it has to be swapped. So in this case I am assigning p1 equal to head. And we found our p1. It is time to find our pointer 2. So to pointer 2 we are going to move both pointers and head till it meets next. So while head.next is not is equal to null then move to moving head to next head to the last node p2 will be at the actual node where it has to be so now swap so once we have swapped let's return the result Let's run. So yes, let's submit. Yes, the solution is accepted. And it runs in 2 milliseconds. So thanks for watching the video. If you like the video, hit like and subscribe. And do let me know in comments. Thanks for watching. Thank you.